let's talk about sugar, especially fructose. Fructose is a form of sugar. Now, regular sugar or table sugar is called sucrose, and that is a 50-50 mix of glucose and fructose. Fructose is a sugar that's naturally found in fruit, honey, some starchy vegetables. That's not my focus today. Today I want to talk about processed forms of fructose, like high fructose corn syrup. You'll find this in all sorts of sweets, candy, sodas, but also hidden frequently in processed packaged foods, dressing, sauces, think tomato sauce. Natural forms of fructose like fruit don't bother me because the fiber in it is going to slow and limit the absorption of fructose, but the processed forms, if eaten enough, those high amounts of fructose will be hard on the liver and can act like a toxin to the liver like alcohol. Why? Because most cells in our body can use glucose for, for fuel, but not fructose. So most of our body cannot use fructose for fuel. Oh, except cancer cells, and let's not feed those. Fructose has to go straight to the liver to get processed. And it may get converted to glucose, but a lot of times it's converted and deposited as fat. Hello, fatty liver. And then also fructose metabolism creates triglycerides and uric acid. So if you have high triglycerides or gout, you probably have fatty liver. All these conditions are associated with insulin resistance, and that contributes to most all chronic disease. Not to mention that fructose reacts with proteins and fats in our body to create inflammation. Lots of bad stuff. So what do you do? Isn't it obvious? Really gotta watch what we're, what we're eating, avoid processed packaged foods, read labels, and really limit sugar, especially fructose. You may be saying, you're no fun. Well, chronic disease and liver disease is no fun too. Research shows that clicking the thumbs up and subscribe button will make fingers healthy and strong. And besides, it's free.